Welcome to the budget silent keyboard build. <laughs> What's up guys, Sauce here. Hope your day is going well. So today we'll be building a silent keyboard. Let me show you what it sounds like. I know silent keyboards aren't for everyone, but the target audience for this is for those of you who want to use your keyboard in class or at the office. You don't want your coworker telling you, Shh, would you be quiet? No. So the base for this keyboard build is the GMK67. You get your switches, then you get your keycaps, and you have a nice silent build. But you do have to get silent switches. Keep that in mind. The switches that I picked were the Otemu Silent Peaches, and I think you can go for those or you can try other silent switches. There are many nowadays. For the keycaps, I went with these MMD Profile keycaps that give it a muffled sound, and I really like that. Let's get started with the build. So. This is the Zuya GMK67. If you don't know about this keyboard, you need to get one. This keyboard is really budget. I think the original price was $90, but nowadays you can find it for almost as low as $20. I remember last week I got one for $20. The first one I got was $50. Nowadays you can get this for really cheap. So for this build, we will take the stabilizers out and lube them. They come pre lubed but I don't think that it's good enough. So we'll take those out and then lube them with GPL 205 and then with keyboard oil as well. Just so it's well lubricated. I forgot to mention this at the beginning of the video, but we'll compare this keyboard to the high ground silent glacier switches, the Opal Base 65 keyboard with silent glacier switches. And then we'll compare it with the KTT Kang Whites on my GMK67 build. I forgot to take a video of myself taking this keyboard apart for the first time, but when you're taking it apart for the first time, it really feels like it's not going to open. You have to use a lot of strength the first time opening it. Don't be scared. It won't break. And now let's get into the sound test. We'll test it with lube, without lube, with the tape mod, without the tape mod, and then against the KTT Can White and High Ground Opal Base 65 with Silent Glacier switches.
and if you made it to the end of the video thank you so much for watching comment below have you seen any silent builds that are more silent than this comment which switches it was and what the build was or link it below also i'm doing a giveaway right now for the holy panda v1 and v2 if you missed my last video the link will be in the description for that video so you can go ahead and go over to that video watch it and then enter that giveaway see you on the next one bye